This is called a Jesus stick because if you forget to use it and have high voltage, uh, that's the uh, 500 pound transformer, 12 and a half kilovolts, 4 amps. This is the plate cap. That down there is uh, the filament transformer. Um, over here is a tube. I need to get in there, there to inspect a, a problem we're having with the tuning on this thing. So hopefully this doesn't arc. This is my ground, grounded. Here we go. Yay! Because if that does arc, it scares the holy crap out of you. So everything there is good. We're going to hang that. So when I pull the tube cavity uh, apart, I get my hands in there. Don't get any uh, stray shocks. Got the screws out. Here are all the bronze screws they use. Here's the 4CX20000C and the chimney tuning mechanism. What I'm interested in, we're going to take my, even though I know I have this stick over here grounding out, we're going to take this and we're going to touch this to the tube just to make sure the tube has no residual voltage on it. Here we go. Nope. No. No voltage on the plate. Just for the hell of it. We're just going to touch a little bit of everything. Make sure because you only get across this high voltage one time in your life. Uh, Alright, so I have a cap back there. It's got a ground strap and I need to inspect that ground strap. I suspect it might be burnt up, causing the, the transfer to be out of tune. We'll report back. So, this is a 40,000 watt FM transmitter. This tube is a 4CX20000A. Um, I have a burned up ground strap right here, which is the uh, plate loading cap. And to remove this tube, to get to this, I gotta remove this tube. You undo a big hose clamp here, which ties the uh, anode to the chimney. And this hose clamp here, this whole chimney slides up. As such and then we can lift the tube out of the, the socket here so you gotta lift this up a bit more tube. This is this normal discoloration. Um, this is a silver plated tube and uh, heat and airflow creates an oxide. So this is a silver oxide. It looks burnt but it's not. It's gotten warm though. Uh, these tubes do get warm. Uh, it can dissipate 20,000 watts of heat through these fins. Now I gotta lift the tube out of here. Set the tube aside somewhere safe. Now I can get to the uh, plate tuning cap back here. Replace this burnt up, nice and crispy ground strap. I'm going to replace it with some solid copper strap. Let's take a look at the fingers on the tube socket. It looks like one that's a little bit damaged right there. All in all, pretty good shape. There's a one or two that need a little little tweaking. They're pretty good shape.
All right, so I got the strap replaced with my copper, solid copper piece here. That should work more better. There we go, it's running. I'll put 33 and a third kilowatt. Our masks look great. Our tack integrations, 100% power. The spectrum looks good. This looks really nice. Let it run for a half hour. And uh, call it good.